Understanding Market Pullback, a guide for English learners. Hello everyone, today, we're going to dive into a financial term that often appears in news and business discussions, market pullback. Understanding this term is not only useful for those interested in finance but also for English language learners looking to expand their vocabulary in different fields. So, let's get started. A market pullback refers to a situation where there is a temporary decline or reversal in the overall trend of a stock market. This isn't a crash or a long-term downturn, but rather a short-term dip in stock prices. It's important to note that pullbacks are considered normal and healthy in a growing market. They often occur after a period of significant gains. Temporary. A pullback is usually short-lived. Percentage decline. Typically, a pullback involves a decline of about 5% to 10% in stock prices. Part of a larger trend. Despite the decline, the overall market trend remains positive. It's crucial to distinguish a market pullback from a market correction. While both involve a drop in stock prices, a market correction is more severe, with declines of 10% or more. Corrections also suggest a possible change in market trends, which isn't necessarily the case with pullbacks. Market pullbacks can be triggered by various factors, such as economic reports, data indicating economic slowdowns or overheating, political events, elections, policy changes, or international conflicts, market speculations, investor reactions to news or rumors. For investors and those interested in finance, Understanding market pullbacks is crucial for making informed decisions. It helps in distinguishing normal market fluctuations from serious downturns. I hope this video has helped clarify what a market pullback is and why it's an important concept in the financial world. Remember, in the stock market, ups and downs are normal, and understanding these terms helps in navigating this dynamic environment. See you in the next video.